and uh, old, uh, sorry, and you, 1991, who's on Baby Squirrel Watch tonight. Uh, that sounds interesting. You found a uh, abandoned orphan squirrel. Oh well, good luck with that. And also, just uh, to everyone, this is quite serious, this bit actually. To everyone on the east coast of America who is being affected or has somebody they know and care about affected by the hurricane, I hope you're all staying safe, taking care and looking after yourselves. And, well, you know, our thoughts are with you. If you can watch any of this, of course, I've heard reports that there's power down and net down and then net up and power up in all sorts of areas over there. So if anyone is watching, then our thoughts are with you and I hope that you are looking after yourselves. Pan, you got to tease me. How else am I supposed to pick up the pace? That's true. That's true. I need keeping on my toes. <laughs> and of course, it is the great British tradition taking the mick out of each other and abusing each other. Right That's what friends do. <laughs> it is. It is, actually. For anyone in Europe watching that, thinking I'm being sarcastic. No, no, that's that's exactly what best mates do and friends do in Britain. They abuse each other. So, so I talked about going off and doing some main quests tonight, I think. Um, hmm. Yes, actually, I need to have a look because I don't actually know what quest I was up to in the main quest. Obviously, I've got this vengeance thing that's been running for a while. I've got to find Markvart von Aulitz and avenge my parents. Find out where this counterfeit coin is coming from. That was right. Uh, so when we handed that last quest in to Sir Radzig, there was this talk about that big chest of money that was rescued from the pr pr purse of uh, the village that we raided last time and took back. Um, and it was all counterfeit, which was a bit of a disappointment. So that's where that leads on. And here we've got to interrogate a captive in Merijed. So that's, I guess, is where we're going. And find out what happened to Matthias. Who is Matthias? I think he's one of my old buddies from Skalitz, right? What the hell are these other things? Oh, that's to go and find a priest. That's to go and find Father Godwin. Oh, God, that is a bit out of the way, isn't it? Where the hell am I, by the way? Where the hell am I? Did I end up back in the Dechko? Okay, I wasn't expecting that. I thought I'd be in Sassau. Hmm. Hey, General Blunder. How's it going? Yes, yes, yes. It is a case in point. You are encouraged to abuse Mark. It is in the rules. If you do exclamation rules, you'll see that it's in there. Uh, so I've got to go to Merhyed. I've got to go to... I don't need to go to Talmberg. I've got to go to Ushitz to talk to Father Godwin, but that's a long way off. Hmm. I think it's all, all about going here. Of course, it depends on... How much stuff am I carrying? Not much. What about my horse? Not too much. I don't need a human metal shield anymore. I'll sell that at the next opportunity. Stealth gear. Plenty of potions. Ancient map. Oh, we did all the maps, didn't we? All the maps I have. Which is a good point, because sometimes... Where's my bed? Um, sometimes you need to talk to just random NPCs, and you'll find an extra treasure map. I must remember to do that a little bit more, I think. The traders, in particular, they often sell them. Yeah, the pan, it's in the rules. <laughs> you can see it down there. I think, I think, I think the rules are actually listed down below as well. And also, I think you can do exclamation commands. You can see a full list of the commands and custom commands for this channel as well. I think I've added one or two more on since last time. Or since last time I talked about them. So I'm in Ledechko. I don't think I've got anything I particularly want to do. I don't want to go and do the chumps down by the River the Archery thing. I kind of finished that. Unless there's another archery tournament somewhere. I still need to do some unarmed fighty stuff, don't I? Because I do have that quest. Here, do me a favour, punch me. Hmm. I can I can I think I think I have to level up to a certain level, maybe 15, before I can go and find the next set of fights. And that was fishy business, which was more fights. Don't know where that continues from. Queen of Sheba's sword. Maybe I could collect all the swords on that. All the sword pieces, get the sword built. Let's let's do some of the main quests. Even if we don't do all of it. So I want to go to Merhajed. I just fast travel. I'll fast travel. See if we meet the Riddler on the way. It won't let me. Why won't it let me? Because I'm clicking the wrong thing. Let me go. Damn it. There we go. We are off. Hmm. 
fighting on Friday night, EB. Yep, Friday night is the night for fighting. Despite what it says in the song, it's Friday night where I come from. Hi, Typhon. No, you haven't missed much. We've just started the stream. Started a bit late today. Friday night, normally my... What the hell? Oh, some, this is this part of the quest. Something's going on. There's a plague. Uh, something's going on here. I'm warning you. Don't go to Menoyed. Oh, dear. This doesn't sound good. Um, sorry, Typhon. Yeah, Friday night's my slightly late start stream night. Uh, what's going on here then? What the hell is going on? Why are you standing around yelling in the middle of the road? For Christ's sake, lad. Don't you hold your life, dear? There's a plague in Merhoyed. Go while you still can. No, there isn't. No, there wasn't. This is a setup. Sir Radzig Kobolo sent me. I can help you. You've a good heart, boy, but take my advice. Nothing good awaits you here. Farewell. Hmm. Oi, oi. Be a bit more. Oi. Come what back the here. Hell? Jesus, Am I going to tackle you, you to the ground? I haven't finished with you yet. Let's try that bit again. I think there's more information to be gained here. Why are you standing around yet? For Christ's sake. Right, so the plague. Yes, we've got the plague. <laughs> plague, get away from me. Maybe I could help you out. Did you not hear me? There's a plague in Merhoyed. Let the Lord strike me down if I'm lying, but go ahead if you doubt my hmm. word. Farewell. We do indeed doubt your word. There's more to this than meets the eye. I mean, wasn't the place just... Have I missed something? Did something happen? Is that the guy from Kung Fu? Uh, he maybe looked a bit like that. <laughs> Who likes Call of Duty Blackout, the, the, the new game? Oh, I should say, I don't think Gremma's in the chat yet tonight, but uh, uh, one of our members, community members, Gremma, very generously offered me a beta key for Blackout 2. Game saved. Something's about to kick off here. Um, but I, I didn't, it was very good of them. I've actually got the game pre-ordered, so I'm going to get to play it when it comes out. I didn't take it because I figured everyone and their uncle is going to be streaming Call of Duty, uh, Blackout or Black Ops, whatever it's called, the beta this weekend. So I thought, nope, we'll do something a bit different. What the hell's going on here? Okay, we've got dead stuff. That ain't just a play. Oh, hang on. Is that a pile of dead horses? Holy crap. Is that a dead rooster as well? It's a dead rooster as well. All right. And this is quite haunting music we've got playing as well. What's going on? This isn't a plague though, is it? Hang on. We've got someone sighted up ahead. Yeah, plagues. We've still got people here. Let's go see. Let's go see what's going on. Saturday night's all right for fighting is Elton John. Elton got it wrong. It's Friday night that's the night for fighting. Right, Melikar. What's Melikar? going on? Oh, that's me. I was lucky. I need to speak with the prisoner. And why is that? Who might you be? Henry, envoy of Saradze Kobola. I'm here to investigate the attack. I'm sorry. I have other things on my mind right now. Hmm. In case you hadn't noticed, we have pestilence raging here. And Sir Adzig won't help us with that. 60% of the time, we it works every time. Hey, Brucalizer, thanks for the uh, subscription there. Well, that's very nice of you, thanks. Um, this is this is strange. This is like... I wasn't no expecting this. Rat eye of any disease here. But I'm here now, and I can help you. Hmm. Well, since you serve Sir Adzig, you might be of some use. If anyone can be. Tell me what to do. There's hmm. a stable hand living with us here, Matthias. Yes, I know him. And he knows some girl who helps out in the monastery infirmary. Your hanker, I think her name is. She might know someone to turn to, if she's actually there. Okay, this has been making sense so far. Plague, time to raise the whole village to the ground along with everything and everyone in it. Hmm, kill it with fire. Good idea. We'll hold that as a last resort. 
might have crossed your mind to send someone there sooner. <laughs> People are barely venturing outside their own homes. They're so scared. And word has got around that the plague is raging here. If someone met us wandering about, well, I'd fear the worst. And besides, you're the envoy of Saradzik hmm. Miller himself. Your word will carry more weight in the monastery than some lowly peasants. Do they like me in the monastery? Do they? Very well. I'll go to the monastery. It's probably our best hope. I need to find out more what's going on around here. At least for taking the trouble. But then, even if you cared nothing for us, the prisoner's got the pestilence too. He'll die without help. Hmm, well, if, if this I is... to go to the monastery, I need to know as much as possible about the disease. I'll definitely need to know its symptoms. They're bound to ask me that. It's hard to say. My wife is feverish. Others have the chills. I heard some are throwing up. Others still are breaking out in sores. Oh, that's not good. But why don't you see for yourself? People talk a lot and I don't mm. know what to believe anymore. Very well. I'll make the rounds. I mm. draw lime on the afflicted houses. But don't stay too long in those homes. Can Henry get that plague? I can promise you. Ah. Okay. So, should we see what the guard has to say? Nothing. Okay. What there you go. It? There's one. There's one. Right, this is probably a really stupid idea. But let's go in. I was going to say, if this really is the plague, there's nothing much that 15th century medicine can do for these people. <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear. Careful, Henry. Of the time, Careful. It works every time. Uh, Annie, 1991, thank you very much. How's the squirrel care going? Who are you? Can't you see we have the plague cross on the door? Uh, which do I do? Which do I do? I'm, I'm, I'm here to help. My name is Henry. I'm going to the monastery to get But help. stand it's back. It's long past time. The Lord's already taken my poor Anthony. And what do you want from me? He's need dead. To know how the illness afflicted your husband. Yes, I'll tell you everything. But first help me bury my husband. I'm too weak. And Melikar said the dead should be buried at once. Oh, God. I've got a spade, I suppose. <laughs> I'm not touching a plague-infected corpse. That would be the sensible course of action. I around other infected houses, too. But then I'll be back and I'll help you. Thank you. But please do come back. I can't do it alone. My husband had the fever all over. Mm -hmm. Anything else? He had great pains in his belly. God's sake. He said it felt like he'd been stuffed with rocks. He was writhing all night through. He must have hurt terribly. Is this... Okay. Sounds more like dysentery or something, but then that's <laughs> normally quite explosive. What am I to do? Grab the body. I think... I don't think I want to do that just yet. Probably isn't an appropriate time to go around picking locks, is it? Hmm. Not having much luck with the little squirrel? Oh, that's shame. Shame. Leeches are the second best medicine. They probably were one of the best medicines available at this time. Cure lots of things. Hang on, is that a trough? No, it's not in use. If I wash myself in every trough, I get the chance. Yeah, I don't think it's going to have any effect really in the game, but we're not taking chances. So that was one. So we've got gut's sake. A guy with rocks in his guts. Anyone here? No, nope, this all looks clear. I think I'm in the stable bit, aren't I? Okay, so that's our clue at the moment. Here's one. Hmm, that suddenly went dark. Oh, crap. What? Uh, oh, oh, dear. You're out of luck. I'm old Straw, don't you know? Straw, you've taken my son. But you shan't take my wife, you bastard. This guy's delirious. We're just going for that. Calm down, Straw. You're telling me to calm down. Why the fuck should I be calm? Because if you don't calm down, wow. I'll make you regret it. Wow. Oh, now we're talking. Come on, then, you Oh, bastard. wow, okay. Come on. Fail on the 20, eh? Right. You asked for it, son. Yeah. Smack, smack. I wanted some fights, didn't I? Yeah. <laughs> This is Henry's idea of helping people who are poorly. 
smack. Why? I'm too close to the guy, that's why. I want to land it smack. Left and a right. Oh, I'll just get him in the corner. Oh, he switched. Smack, smack. He's going down now. What do I do? I tell you, what, I'm not eating any of the food in this place. But we will pick that lock. <laughs> there might be clues. There might be clues in it. We've got a genuine reason. What? Hang on. You were, you went no. down. Arrest that thief. I knocked him out. How the hell did he get up so quickly? Thief. You... Right, okay. Got ya. Right. Now, I'll fix you good and now what's going on? What means. Seriously. What? I'm bullying the poor idiot. So well. The thief takes us all <clears> fools. I'll show you how we deal with poor innocent me's here. And it's not just a theft you will answer for. Why? What else have I well, done? You won't forget this in a hurry, because it will take a nice pile of coin to fix it. Okay. Which one am I going to go for? I've got twenty on that, or nineteen on speechcraft. Let's go for that one. Oh come on, my friend. You know I'm in the <sighs> service of Sir Radzik Cobbler, don't you? No, I'll be leaving uh, the local food I well didn't, away, Pan. Don't I didn't worry. Know that. My apologies. Go ahead. <laughs> Go ahead and steal it. <clears throat> right, Watchman. Good day to you. What do you know about this going on? Um, what's happened? What's happened here? Things are bad, very bad. First we get attacked by them brigands, barely come out of that alive, and now the plague. It's a bit coincidental, plague, you say? Indeed, so. Something's up with the village. Even the livestock are dying. It's a gruesome sight. Sorry, uh, Predator, did I miss a, um, a message there from you? You'll ask again, you have a code for Call of Duty Blackout, the new game. You're not lying, does anyone want it? Just whisper. Oh, that's, that's very good of you, thanks. Uh, if anyone wants it, feel free to get in touch with uh, with Predator there. That's uh, that's very kind of you. That's that's what would be really cool in this community. If anyone gets any codes or stuff they don't want, feel free to share it with the others or any, any games to give away free stuff like that, then we'll stick to games and codes and stuff <laughs> rather than... Uh, food and ladies underwear and things in case you've got to get any ideas but um yeah that'd be that'd be great share it around folks if you've got any any games and stuff prepare to fight i shall vomit on your possessions thy insolent mushroom hmm that doesn't sound that doesn't sound very nice pan let's hope we don't find anyone who says that to me so let's let's get the information here i don't know some bandits Ever since Scullets was raised, they've been marauding the whole province. Did you put up a fight? We most certainly did. Once Melikar heard young Straw shouting to the hills, he handed everyone a pitchfork or a flail, and we ambushed the bastards. Nice. Good on you. How did it turn out? We gave them what for until they turned tail and ran. But they cut up young Straw something awful. He didn't live Hang on. Sea morning. Oh, that, that was Old Straw, wasn't it? That was Old Straw that we met there. Who are these idiots? Who are Melikar and Straw? That's right, you're not from around here, are you? Melikar's the one looking after things around here now. Before that, it was down to Smil from the Neuhof stud. But they killed him that time they raided the place. And young Straw is the son of Andrew, a local woodcutter. Or was, I should say. The bandits mm. saw to that. His old man isn't taking it well. I don't think I want to hang around this uh, plague-stricken house. Where will I find Melikar? If you stand at the main gate of the stables and look across the road, Melikar's is the house on the left. I better ask all these questions, because I'd like well, we're in his house, but I see. Well, if you stand at the main gate of the stables and look across the road. You'll see Straw's house on the right. Yep, that's exactly where we are. Tell me more about this plague. It sounds terrible. Worse than you can imagine. The whole stud, livestock, hmm. sheep, chickens, now that's unusual. all dead or dying. No doubt the people will be next. Melikar's old woman's taken to her bed, and it doesn't look good. Straw's wife and brother. More and more. I'm sorry to hear it. Well, for something to take out all the livestock, 
It sounds more like a poisoned water supply to me. I'm looking for Matthias. He works as a stable hand at the stud farm. Matthias? The brigands got him. Poor lad. He's lying wounded at the stud. The best strategy is licking people. Nobody likes to get licked and will forget about fighting or at least distract them because they'll be grossed out. I suppose if you were covered in paws, uh, sores and, and bleeding paws and all sorts and then started licking people, <laughs> they would probably be definitely grossed out. Okay, so Matthias is wounded. Here, Not good. Luckily, young Straw saw them still over by the cross <clears> and woke the whole village. We even captured one. He's tied up now at Melikar's place. But then the disease came. Okay. Thanks. Right. That'll be all for now. Uh, let's go and talk to the, to the captive. Talk to captive. Sorry, no one's allowed inside. Melikar's orders. Right. So I need to get I need to get this place fixed. But I'm Sir Radzig Cobbler's envoy, and I urgently need to question the captive. I don't care if you're the Pope's envoy. I can't let you in. If you want to talk to the captive, you have to get permission from Melikar. Right. God okay. And I'm guessing Melikar isn't gonna let us. Be a bit more careful. Is that another chest? Yeah. I don't need that. Melikar's not going to let us unless we cure the plague. Mother of God, I can't bear oh, hang on. She's not dead. Fever. Just like Melikar's wife. Okay. Fever. His old straw. Are you going to talk to me now? No? I should give him a good pasting. Right. Did we learn anything useful from that? I think I need to go back to the stud, which is here, and find Matthias. No, oh, hang on, I don't want to break in. Just Not just yet. Just wash myself. Wait, is that him? It is. <clears throat> How? You're a sight for sore eyes. What are you doing here? It's good to see you too, Matthias. Sir Radzig sent me here to investigate the raid. Sir Radzig? Looks like you've come up in the world, mate. You're here as his envoy? Yeah, something like that. But that's not important right now. Well, I'm Nicely glad downplayed. to see you have a job. Lots of our old neighbours have been reduced to begging. If I were in your shoes, I'd get the hell out of here. There's some disease spreading. Disease? Yes, Henry, Focus there's a disease. The plague. Whatever it is, it's bad. It started the day after the raid. First the horses got sick, then other animals, and now people are falling ill too. Oh, damn. So, thinking about this, it sounds like a poison water supply because the same disease that affects animals rarely affects humans as well. I can't think of many that do, but a poison water supply would, would surely do it. Are you all right? Well, at least I haven't caught the sickness. But you've been hurt. It happened during the raid. One of those damn bandits fell on me, horse and all. Mm. My arm's badly broken, but better than a broken I neck. I can fix that. If you'll give me the option. Tell me about the raid. What do you want to know? I hear one of the raiders was taken captive. I'd like to question him. Why, old Melikar let him have it over the head with a flail, and now he's locked up in the barn. But be careful. Why's that? That fucker killed young Straw, and his old man's sharpening his sickle for him. Melikar still hasn't decided right. what to do with him. Right, okay. I'll have to kill Straw. I can tell you what he'll do with him. He'll hand him over to Sir Radzig's envoy. Me. I doubt Melikar will let him go willingly. The folk here are baying for blood. Lives have been lost. First the raid, and now this plague. God knows what they'll do. Hmm. What were Did these raiders? The raiders? I don't know. They came at dusk, so you couldn't see their faces. About 20 of them. They weren't humans, though. They spoke Czech. You talked to them? Okay. No, no. They were shouting at us. They were very sure of themselves to begin with, but when we hit them in the woods, they didn't look so brave. 
not humans. But how did a bunch of untrained villagers manage to hold off armed bandits? One of the village lads caught sight of them coming through the woods and told Melikov, who roused the whole village, and everyone grabbed what they could. Pitchforks, axes, flails, and we went out to face them. What? You mounted an assault against them? Aye, and that was the key. It was the last thing those whore sons <laughs> expected. A few of them still managed to break through to the village, probably wanted to torture. But even the women here were armed with what they could find, and they took the bastards by surprise. Proper fight then. Hey, smack my Twitch up. Welcome along tonight. Uh, okay, okay, so we've got a bit of information there. That was the raid. Uh, we've talked about the raid, right? Tell me about the raid. Hang on a minute, we've done, we have. I hear you captured one, yeah, but we've, we've asked that already. I hear one of the raiders was taken captive. Why, old Melikar, let him have it over. Yeah, we did. Like so why is that why is that showing up? Oh, because there's another option to go through, I that's why. I think. But first I have to question that bandit. What happens after is no skin off my nose. Good luck then. Okay. Yes, that's got that quest thing. Not the quest thing, it's got the text option grayed out now. Good, didn't want to miss anything. About this sickness. Hmm. When did this plague start? The day after the raid, the horses were lying down in the stable, so we knew something was up. By afternoon, they were all dead. Then other animals started getting sick, one after the other, and then people. It's got to be in the water, surely. What are the signs that someone's getting sick? Well, I don't leave the house much, but folk complain of fever and shakes. Some are throwing their guts up, and others are spewing from the other end. Has anyone died from it? Nice. Aye, old Burba. Although he was already on his last leg, so no one knows for sure if it was the plague. Okay. Either way, the animals are dropping like flies, and people will end up the same for sure. What's the primary water supply source? I don't know about this place. River? Is there a well? We'll have a look. Now. We'll figure this out. I don't know. What with my arm the way it is, I don't go outdoors much. But I know Melikar and Straw had sick ones at home. Okay, I think we've got... Everything we want off that. Can I and ask this? you a bit about metal yet? I haven't been here long enough to learn much, but ask away. Is this really anything? Can you tell me something about Old Straw? He's a woodcutter, tough as they come, and a hothead. He's been out of his mind since his boy died. Hmm. It's normal to grieve, though. Depends how you look at it. Folk are afraid he'll snap or drink himself to death. What's worse? His wife caught the sickness, and he's not taking care of her. I mean, he's totally out of his mind. He even thought he saw me trying to steal out of his chest. He's that delirious. Could be fatal, that. Could be fatal. Where can I find this? Oh, we know, we know where he is, don't we? Take the main gate yes, up. we know where he is. What's Melikar like? The locals look up to him. Smil used to be in charge here, but he was killed in Neuhof. I oh, know. Sir Hanush hasn't had time to appoint a new vassal, and folk need someone to speak for them, so they picked Malakar. Hmm, we'll go for that. Thank God you had someone here who could take the reins. Aye. Okay, I think, uh, I think we're done. I think we're done there. And he falls down, collapses back into his pile of straw, and sinks through it, partially. Is he asleep? Can we steal that? No, we'd best not. So there's a guy walking through here with a bucket of water. Was there not? Or a bucket of something, I saw. Johan. We talked Did to these guys here? before. I can't remember. What's happened here? Things are bad. Very bad. First we get attacked by them brigands. Barely come out of that alive. And now the plague. Plague, you say? Indeed so. Something's up with the village. Even the livestock are dying. It, it's a gruesome sight. Okay, well, we've got all the information Thanks. that we need there. I'll be all for now. Good luck to you. Right, so, if it's a well, uh, you're right, Pan, it could, it could be a dead animal falling at the bottom of it. That's quite possible. Should I be washing my...